Hi everybody, this is uh, Jarno, PF3DMI. I'm going to make a, a new dipole for uh, a 6 meter band. Just a simple uh, design. You can find it on the internet. It's uh, made of two pieces of uh, aluminium. Uh, those are 1 meter long. Uh, but for 6 meter I have to have on each side 1 meter 40, 1 meter 45 if I use a center frequency of 50.1 megahertz. So I bought two pieces and a piece which is put inside of the other so so I can adjust the SWR on uh, any frequency uh, and don't have to chop off or add some aluminium because that's always uh, a little bit difficult. Uh, I'm gonna use it and uh, on a base plate of aluminium and the rest is uh, stainless steel or uh, or plastic so no problem with uh, with the weather over here as I said I'm gonna make it of uh, for the frequency of 50.1 because I mainly use CW Morse code so I looked it on the internet uh, there's uh, different websites you can find. I will add it uh, in the description uh, below. So the frequency has to, of the the length of the dipole has to be uh, something about 280 to 290, not precise. So it's nice. I can adjust the length of the of the dipole. Well, let's have a look. I'm gonna take some pictures so you can have a look what I made. So I put the antenna in the attic, it's empty so for the room, not too much uh, metal so uh, I can test it and there's a going uh, small car scale outside. <laughs> to my, uh, this is this the bottom now. So the SWR is uh, nice uh, on the one made uh, from a piece of coax and uh, 20 uh, varied cores. Okay, ah, back I'm in the shack. Uh, 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 first, I connect the antenna. That's the antenna from the from the attic. It works, as far as I know. Okay. And in the attic, the SWR was uh, almost one on one, so it won't make any difference over here. Okay, that's connected. Uh, oh, it's still on 10 meters, so I have to go to yeah, six meter band. Um, 
I see the antenna tuner is still on. Disable that one. Now the antenna tuner is off. I will go to all the way down, almost. This is a lot still uh, power. That's uh, 75. I will try first at uh, 5 watts. If the SWR is uh, very bad, then uh, I won't blow my amplifier. Okay, uh, it's you know, back from tune to meter. It's on SWR. Well, the SWR says nothing. Nothing is always good. <laughs> Power is also nothing. It was on 5 watts now. I will go one megacycle megahertz up. It's still 101. Well. Oh, yeah. Almost in the top of the band, where I never come. It's uh, one on one point four, so that isn't even bad. But I normally are on the CW portion. So back to uh, no, still difficult sometimes. Uh, Okay. Oh, 50 watts. It's still okay. Maximum power I have uh, is uh, 100 watts. Although the the, the balance is, is made for 3 kilowatts. I'm not. I, I don't know how much power you are able to use and are allowed to use, but in Holland it's. Uh, 100 watts or 400 watts PAP with peak envelope power, but wow, well, it's still okay. One megahertz up, yeah, nee. well, it's still it's still okay. But now it's probably almost on top of the band, yeah. As you can look, uh, see, uh, it's uh, it's uh, it's yeah, uh, it's okay. So uh, the design is uh, is okay. Happy with that. Let's see if I can hear something. Probably above 100 or even. No really signals, uh, but the, the 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 antenna works, so that's very nice. And uh, in the in the in spring or just before spring, something in, in March or so, I will put the antenna uh, on the roof and then see if I can make some uh, QSO on that magic band. Uh, sometimes you can make well distance of a kilometers. And sometimes you go the world around, so that's it's very uh, very nice band. So uh, I will leave uh, some uh, uh, descriptions in the comments uh, below, or below the, the, the this picture about links how to uh, make the correct length. There's some uh, there's some websites uh, where you can uh, calculate how long the antenna must be. My antenna on both sides was one meter forty three and a half centimeters, so it's uh, two meters uh, eighty six eighty seven something like that and it works perfect and it's simple it's simple dipole just uh you have to make a balloon uh you can buy those or you online you can find uh, lots of uh, possibilities uh, 
so you can make it yourself. This one is made of a, a piece of uh, Ecoflex 10 and 20 coils. And it's just uh, put through and connected to the antenna. And it works because you yeah, need a balance because in principle the, the, the impedance of a uh, dipole is uh, 75 ohms. And normally you use 50 ohms. And I, 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 my uh, air cell is also 50 ohms. So, well, hope you enjoyed my, my small uh, dipole uh, movie. If you have any questions, uh, leave it in the comments and uh, read about the uh, in the descriptions uh, the websites I found uh, to calculate the correct length and maybe some uh, other uh, nice things. Okay, have uh, have a good uh, day. And uh, maybe until next time, or otherwise on six meter band. Bye bye.